What is goody? What is poppin? It is your boy Jet back with another video and today I want to talk about Kimetsu no Yaiba aka Demon Slayer because Demon Slayer will be returning with its third season very soon. And you know the first two seasons were top notch anime viewing experiences. But I'm still not a fan of Demon Slayer. Like don't get me wrong, it's a good anime but I have like three characters that I for real like. There's Tengen Uzui because he's him. There's Giyu because you know he's pretty cool. And then you got Mitsuri because she has the best plot. But there is one character in this anime that I absolutely despise and that is the one the only baby back bitch himself, Zenetsu. Now, I know some of you are shocked that I said I hate your favorite character, Zenetsu, but I hate to break the news to you, but you were manipulated. You were tricked into liking this character, and I'm not saying you can't like him, your body, your choice, but you know, knowledge is power, my friend. Yeah. And first off, to all the people who say they like Zenetsu, no you don't. You don't actually like him. You like Zenetsu that is sleepwalking. And the only reason that you like sleep mode Zenetsu is because compared to his cowardly alter ego, he is far and away the cooler option. But I actually like Zenetsu. No, you don't. No, you don't. You know, it's fine to like sleep mode Zenetsu. So do I. But only when he's on sleep mode. Ayo, hey, put this into perspective. Imagine someone walks up to you and says that they like you better when you're asleep. Yeah, yeah, that's a messed up thing to say, huh? Which leads into my second point, which is when he's not asleep, he's freaking annoying. Shut up, bitch! Like, there's no logical way anyone finds awake mode Zenetsu likable. Like, there's just no possible way. I refuse to believe people actually like the whiny simp version of Zenetsu. Whenever I see this character with his eyes open, I just want to sock him in the jaw so bad, bro. Whenever this character is fighting and he's awake, I just fast forward to the point where he falls asleep because that's the only redeeming quality of Zenetsu. Like, what was the author cooking when they made this character like this, bro? Like, there's no way that they wrote Zenetsu like this and thought people will like him. Like people call Deku a crybaby, but he has never ran from the smoke. He has never cried in the face of the ops. This man Deku went toe to toe, blow for blow with the biggest menace in the entire planet while this bum Zenetsu saw a spider and ran away like a little bitch. And then we have reason three for why you should hate Zenetsu. And that's when he's not wetting his pants, he's simping over girls. It's a new era and we are past the point of simp male characters. They are annoying and they serve no purpose whatsoever. And we need to stop giving characters this character trait. And the worst thing about Zenetsu is that he doesn't even simp normally. He straight up commits sexual harassment. Like bro, it's 2023, that shit's not cool. But you all like that side of Zenetsu, right? You all like the side of Zenetsu that sexually harasses women. I mean, come on. He simped so hard that he went bankrupt. He became a demon slayer to earn money because he was in debt. And he still hasn't learned his lesson. He is still out here simping. Matter of fact, this man is such a hardcore max prestige simp that he doesn't even care if a girl's a demon. He's still gonna simp after her. Like, bro, do you have no dignity? This man Zenetsu is really out here harassing a underage female demon. Like, someone lock this man up. And to top it off, he ends up marrying her. What the hell? Oh my god, no way. Bro, what the fuck? There you go, ladies and gentlemen. Demon Slayer has taught you that if you harass your crush enough, you will get them eventually. I can't do this anymore, bro. Just cut it. Cut it!